Hello, I'm going to discuss and demonstrate thin lenses. Here I have a diagram of a, uh, of a diverging lens, a lens that's thin in the center, thicker at the edges, raised parallel to the axis, come up, and they travel off in this direction as if coming from a virtual focal point back here. So this diverging lens takes parallel rays and causes those rays to diverge as if coming from a virtual focal point. Notice that a lens has a focal point on the other side as if light were coming up from the other direction as well. I'll just show the focal point on this side for now. Here's the converging lens. This converging lens takes light rays that are coming up parallel to the axis and causes them to converge through a real focal point over here. And uh, similarly, if we had light coming from the other direction, then those parallel rays coming up from the other direction would come to a focal point on this side. So lenses, unlike mirrors, have two focal points. Next, what I'd like to do is demonstrate this with uh, the aid of the blackboard optic system here, which I'll describe in just a minute. And we're going to show uh, various lenses. Here is a diverging lens, and we're going to have light uh, come up from the, uh, from the system here of uh, rays of light from this uh, source on the chalkboard. I'll turn the lights down a little bit so we can see that a little better. Here we have some parallel rays. Those parallel rays come up to this diverging lens and you can see they spread out or diverge as if coming from a virtual focal point back here on the same side of the lens as the light source. Notice it doesn't matter very much if I turn the lens around the other direction as long as it's thin in the center thick at the edges, it'll cause parallel light rays to diverge. So next I'd like to uh, discuss a uh, converging lens. That's the lens that's thick in the center and thin at the edges. And uh, we'll turn the lights down so that we can see the rays of light on the uh, blackboard optics system here. With the lights down, I'm going to hold this converging lens up here and we see that parallel light rays converge to a real focal point. If I turn the lens around, we notice that the focal length is essentially the same. Uh, next, I'd like to show what happens if I put two lenses in combination and show that we can get an even shorter focal length. Real focal point for a converging lens.